This is a simplified example of uh, running in Kuja, the Contiki simulator, uh, RPL. Uh, this uh, setting, this setup uh, is obviously that every node is connected to each other in order to go up to the sink. And uh, over here we can see that each node is sending packets, UDP packets, to the sink. As soon as the sync receives them, it sends them back to the node, which acknowledges by uh, printing the RTT time, the, uh, the time it took for the packet to go up and down again. N over here, we can see the obvious that node 2, which is closer to the sync, it takes the less time to uh, send the packet, and node 5, which is further away from the sync, takes uh, the bigger time to send a packet this is a very simple example, simplified example of how to force a node in RPL to change parents. Why we want to do that? Because we want there are cases where we want a peer-to-peer -peer communication to be favorable instead of uh, all nodes connecting to the sync. Now, this uh, this very simplified network has the sync on the top and two nodes in each side which means obviously that number two and number three will be one branch and the other branch will be number four and number five. As we can see very well here, they all send messages um, to the sync, uh, among other uh, informations. The important thing is that we want to see if we can force number five to change parents. Uh, and instead of having parent as a parent, obvious parent number four, to switch to number three. Now we have a very simplified uh, objective function which is favoring certain nodes based on their color. In other words, uh, the objective function is adding, uh, is lying to the system, if you want, and giving a different weight on every node which has a specific color. Uh, we, uh, we will see how to do that. This is an advanced uh, example of uh, uh, trying to apply peer-to-peer uh, -peer objective function in RPL. At the beginning, the RPL is running with the default uh, objective function and uh, hence it's creating the dodec with the sync uh, as uh, at the peak. Now, all nodes are trying to connect to the sync as best as, best as possible. They all send messages to the sync, except number three, node number three, which is sending messages to node number two. As you can see here, after the network starts, they all start sending messages to number one. Uh, forward and everybody is forwarding the messages. Those are those are extra messages created in uh, network layer, an RPL network layer, in order to have uh, details for all uh, stations. Now, what we care is uh, especially from number three to number two. As you can see, messages are, are received and there is a response. The receiving station is sending the message back to the sender.